All right, so in this video, we're gonna be unboxing the FaceGood P1. Now, I'm pretty excited about this one because this is much better than what I have right now, which is the D2. Now, a big shout out to Jello for letting me play around with this. Uh, with that being said, let's go ahead and open this up. It comes in a really nice hard case shell right here. And additionally, it came in a really nice crate, even though I think Customs did open the crate, but I don't think they opened the box. So that's pretty good. So it was really well protected as far as the transport. And here is the content. Okay, so with that being said, you can see that there's a lot more components to this than my actual D2 helmet. Well, that's because this is actually wireless. And additionally, it can shoot up to 60 frames per second, which I think is much needed when it comes to facial animation. So let's go ahead and break this down here. All right, so this right here is actually the SDI input express card that you're gonna have to put in your system. So I did get a question regarding this. This system will come with its own SDI in and SDI out. So you don't need to buy anything extra. It already comes with the system. So this is pretty sweet, All right? So we actually have the helmet itself right now. I'm gonna pull out and this thing, and let me go ahead and get this out first. Got a little foam right there. Smells really good, smells brand new. And we do have the actual camera right here. And again, it is super duper lightweight. We got some cables in here, which eventually is gonna be plugged in on the back. Now I'm gonna be making a different tutorial as far as setting this up. But as you can see, we have the camera right here. It's a little bit of vent, because it does shoot 60. You do have some infrared lights, kind of like around this area right now, around this bar. So that's kind of nice. And yeah, this is, really really lightweight all right it looks like we have some belt straps got a nice little velcro there has face good on it so we'll take a look at this again in the setting up and this right here is the lemon sachet do not eat this thing okay so we got some sdi cables looks like we got some limo cables as well if you're familiar with Red cables, it's, it looks pretty similar to that. SEI and Limo. Again, this is a V-mount D-tap to a Limo cable. Probably to power the system here. Again, if you're a camera geek, you should know what that is. This just looks, looks kind of cool. I wonder what you're supposed to be putting right here. This is a really nice, well-made custom laser cut foam, by the way just to say it out there. All right, what do we have right here? We got some boxes. Use my knife right here. All right, let's see what this small rig is. Allen wrench. Oh, okay, so it's like a, it's a D-tap belt adapter from small rig, which is cool because I actually buy small rig stuff. <laughs> That's pretty neat that they're using small rig. Small rig, if you're not familiar with that, that's a really nice camera accessory company. Makes a lot of cool, cheap accessories for your cameras, DSLR, filmmaking stuff. Yeah, it's a small rig mini V-mount battery plate with belt clip. So we have two of those. All right, so we do have this SDI HDMI transmitter, looks like. It's either gonna be the transmitter or the receiver. It looks like TX. So this is probably gonna be your transmitter right here. FaceGood does give you a 50 watt hour V-mount battery already with the system, but I do have some V-mount batteries as well, just kind of laying around from my kind of like filmmaking videography days. This is the charger for the V-mount battery right here, which is cool, pretty nice. Again, I do have some V-mount chargers that I can always use and this, should be the receiver, RX. Yep, there's an, there's an RX right here on the label. This is your receiver. So this is what's going to be plugged into your computer. And this one right here is gonna be what's gonna be on your talent's body. So smaller, you can see this is smaller and this is bigger. Okay, again, we'll check out the setup here shortly. Okay, so we got a silicon swim cap if you wanna go swimming. Um, while you're doing mocap, you can use, no, I'm just kidding. This is pretty much, you put this on your head so that the helmet doesn't slide on and off. 
if you have like silky hair, like smooth silky hair like I do, sometimes the helmet will come off so you can wear this. Always use protection guys. All right, let's move on. And we have, it looks like a power adapter. Yeah, this is a power adapter. All right, so we have a power adapter. Oop, fell out. So this is your traditional AC power adapter. Let's see if it's 110 and 240. It sure is, it's dual voltage, so that is good. We have four antennas, two for our transmitter and two for our receiver, like so. Pretty awesome. All right, as far as unboxing, unless there's like a hidden compartment here, that's pretty much it. That is everything that comes with the FaceGood P1. And again, it looks kind of scary right now, but to be honest, this, I mean, if you're familiar with wireless monitors, it looks pretty similar to that kind of setup, you know, that you're using nowadays for filmmaking. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the unboxing. I cannot wait to try this helmet out. Pretty excited uh, because this is, again, wireless that shoots 60 frames per second. That is infrared as well. So, and here it is, the FaceGood P1.